what it do leo 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 so leo we just gonna tap into your energy and i'm gonna take out one card and i'm gonna build a reading around that one card okay so once again we're gonna pull one card and see what's going on um around your energy i'm trying to do this outside it's a nice breeze but i don't know how it's gonna flow with this breeze coming on hopefully my cards stay put so okay so father god of the most high um please give us one card to clarify the energy the energy that's going on around our beautiful Leo here, Spirit. Let me see what we got here. Oh, here, yeah, okay. We got the Ace of Wands here, the bottom of the deck, the Three of Pentacles here in reverse. So what I'm getting here, um, Leo, maybe it's like some type of cycle that is broken here. The Three of Pentacles in reverse is about, it could be a separation. It could be um, an ending to some type of contract. It could be like you just walking away and going in with your, you, you're finding passion somewhere else, um, leaving family, maybe where you was before, like you were not feeling supported, okay, is what I'm getting here. Somebody here like to walk on a beach a lot, okay, which is a good thing. That that could be, some of you guys here are on the, on the Cancer and Leo cusp. Let me see his spirit. What else you want to tell us about the Ace of Rods here? But I'm also getting the energy of like some type of passion, some type of sexual passion here. Lord, look at here. The lover's card here. Yep. Gemini energy. Gemini energy. You may be finding your twin flame here. Or this could be, listen, if it's not necessarily lovers, this could possibly just be dealing with contracts, finding a new tribe, a new business partner, somebody here who's in the flow with you. Okay, let me see. Tell me more about this lover's card here, Spirit. Oh, here come the wind. Tell me more about this lover's card here, Spirit, for Leo. Tell me more. Okay, here the Ten of Wands here in reverse. I feel like you're going to find somebody, Leo, who's going to come across you, who's going to help you out, okay? You're not going to be doing things on your own by yourself a lot. Somebody is going to come to you and is going to take the stress off of your back, whatever this may be. You're going to be finding dual partnership with this person. I told you some type of passion. Yeah, the six of swords here in reverse, but be careful because something here may be trying to come back to you. Yeah, you see what I'm saying here? There's an energy here. Look at this. This eight of pentacles here, this three of pentacles here, and this six of swords here. Somebody here is feeling stuck without you, okay? Somebody here is in some type of chaotic type of energy. This could be work related, okay? Or this could be somebody trying to work like they're really focusing on. Somebody is really thinking about how they lost you or the separation. And I feel like it's a little bit too late. The six of wands here in reverse. Yeah, because you don't want this person anymore. Because this person back then did not acknowledge the shit that they were doing, okay? You was not feeling so fulfilled in this relationship. Leo, just by the fact that this is starting off with the ace of wands, you're really passionate in life. You got a lot of enthusiasm. You're the strength card, okay? You're the Leo. You're the lion, okay? Very much into self in a good way. And like I said, you were trying to find somebody who got this equilibrium. Like I said, take it how it resonates, whether it is this is a relationship or if this is just a new community that you're getting into. But you got somebody here who is very jealous here is what I want to say too. You need to be aware of this nine of pentacles here and this page of cups here. Okay, there's nine of pentacles here on the page of cups. So the nine of pentacles in reverse because somebody could be really money hungry and it's an envious type of energy. Be careful of this page of cups, possibly Pisces, this person trying to come to you. Um, maybe possibly making an, an apology. And I'm also getting energy on um, for our divine masculine. Um, this is an energy of someone here pretending like they're pregnant and the fuck that they're not. Okay, I'm getting that here too as well. Okay, hold on. What else you want to tell our um, Leos? Give me more about this. Um, I see the Queen of Swords here. So it's some shit here, Leo, that you cut the bullshit out of, like you were like addressing. Tell us more about this Lover's card here, Spirit, and this Ten of Wands here in reverse. Okay, and the nine of cups. I told you somebody is upset about this whole union. Somebody's upset. Somebody is upset, Leo, because something here is going your way. They're very selfish. What 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 they set out to hurt you, it did not work. You're still having grand beginnings. You're being successful. Okay, they, they, they they're feeling defeated right now. 
they're pissed off about it. Let me see. You see what I'm saying here? The Ace of Cups in reverse because they lost you. And losing you is meaning losing something big. They're depressed about it. You're not even emotionally con connected to this person. You don't want this person anymore. Okay, I feel like this individual took you um took advantage of you. This Nine of Cups in reverse. Yeah, somebody is mad about this partnership. Like, like I said, you are moving into a cycle. I think we either we're in a full moon of Taurus or a full moon of Aries. One of the two. I can't remember. The cycle of you struggling I'm getting here is over with. I wish I would have brought my other cards out here. I forgot I left them inside. Tell me more about this Nine of Cups in reverse. What is this about? This Nine of Cups in reverse here, Spirit, for Leo. You see what I'm saying here? Yep. Look at here. Look at here. You see what I'm saying here? Huh. They low vibrational ass. That's the hair fun here. Taurus type of energy once again here. The Ace of Cups. He in reverse, the Ace of Swords here. Yeah, somebody is somebody is a bit mad. You got the Ace of Swords here in reverse here and the Ace of Cups here in reverse. There's a lot of hostilities as to why you're not with this person anymore. Like this person possibly, here you got the Two of Cups here in reverse. Pisces showing up here again. Okay, like it's a separation. Look at this. There was no need to even move forward. I'm getting the energy that this person possibly... For, number one, I feel like you're avoiding all communication with this person, okay? And I feel like this person does shit to try to make you respond and you don't. You ain't giving their ass the time of day, okay? This is just crazy. Tell me more about this hair front card here in reverse here. And on the Nine of Cups here for Leo. The hair front card here in the Nine of Cups here for Leo. For so some of you guys, too, if you are leaving a job and you're having, you, like I said, you got a grand new step, you know, big things are happening for you. They're going to be pissed the fuck off, too, that you left this institution. They're going to be mad, okay, that you're going to, you're going to, some of you guys are answering to your calling, okay? And it could be somebody on a job, remember the Eight of Pentacles came out, it could be somebody on a job that is aware of this. Somebody get pissed off real close to real close to you. Tell me more about this hair fun here in reverse here and this nine of cups here. In reverse. This hair fun here and this nine of cups in reverse. While I'm here at Thanksgiving, be careful at Thanksgiving dinners. I don't know, this just gave me this. Just give me it. Be careful. Thanksgiving dinner. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. Take it how that resonates. But this hair fun here in reverse here, and this nine of cups in reverse here for Leo. Once again, here the two of wands here. Yep. Yep. You're not giving this individual any type of chance. You're not. Look at here the three of cups here. The Eight of Pentacles. I feel like, remember I was saying how you um, going and find a new tribe? Here we got the Eight of Pentacles here and the Three of Cups here. The Three of Swords here. You're healing. You're moving on. What is this? You're going to find, okay, um, Leo, you're going to find happiness disconnected. This three of pentacles has come up. You're going to find happiness. You notice how the three, this separation or whatever you're leaving, you're going to find fulfillment. Here's you, the queen of wands here. Whatever it is that, whatever this cycle is, you're going to find fulfillment on it. So don't hesitate. Yeah. Somebody has somebody here as a stalemate. The Page of Cups acting real childish. Here it is with this Nine of Pentacles again and this Page of Cups, the Devil card. You got obsessive energy around you, codependent around you here too as well. Yeah. Them being in regret. Just be careful. Somebody could be dealing with um black magic here too as well.
This person is obsessed with the fact that you rejected them. Hold on. I want to see something right quick. Tell me about this Three of Pentacles here in reverse. Can we elaborate more on this spirit? Be clear. Tell me more about this Three of Pentacles in reverse. Tell me more about this Three of Pentacles here in reverse. Okay, yeah, this, yeah. Yeah, there's, there's, yeah, you left this person. The lovers come out again. Gemini energy. Tell me more about this lover's card here in reverse here. And the three of pentacles. Okay, here the king of pentacles here in reverse. Somebody here was real money hungry, I feel. Somebody here did not hold on their end of the bargain. Somebody did not know how to lead. When it came down to earthly matters, you and this person was not connecting okay and that's why you left they bit that they badass this person was controlling had a lot of addiction okay obsessive narcissistic okay so this person tried to keep you attached could be capricorn energy tell me more about this on um, lovers car in reverse and this king of pentacles in reverse here yeah the death car here you fucking ended it ended it scorpio energy yeah because they're a fucking liar and they can't be damn loyal okay let me see this right now Tell me more about this devil card here, spirit. Tell me more about this devil card here, spirit. For Leo. Yep, here the queen of cups. Here somebody who's clingy, controlling, obsessive. Somebody who can't even get their cups filled. This is why they're crying a lot. Third, three of swords here I just seen. A lot of deception, separation of the heart. Tell me more about this um, this queen of cups here in reverse here. And the devil card here, spirit. Tell me more about this. So this is what's going on here. Yeah, the hermit card here in reverse. So you possibly isolate yourself from this person. But this person do shit. They, when they do shit, they think about themselves. They don't use their higher self, okay? Let me see here. Tell me more about this hermit card here. You got a lot of major arcanas here. And this queen of cups here in reverse for Leo. Yeah, up here the strength card here. <laughs> Number one, they fuck ass is weak without you. They try to dominate you, and, and they're very overbearing. They lack. They have like low confidence. Like the shit don't work out with, for this person, Leo. This is showing in reverse, but I don't feel like that's you. This person has low confidence. Okay, you either dealing with a Cancer, Virgo, Capricorn, or another Leo. You got Scorpio here too, and Gemini. Okay, they have a low self esteem. They are obsessed with you. Look what I'm saying here. The justice card here in reverse. Tell us more about this justice card here in reverse. That's Libra energy. Tell us more about this justice card here in reverse. The nine of swords here. Huh. Maybe it's something that you know, or maybe it's something this could be. Um, what is this clarity about? Tell us more about this. Um, Justice card here in reverse and this nine of swords here in reverse. I can't even get the cards together. What's more about this justice card here in reverse and this nine of swords here in reverse? Okay, the knight of pentacles here. So, okay, I don't know. This is kind of giving me an energy because the Knight of Pentacles is something, somebody who is slow moving, but it's calculated steps that they're using. This Nine of Swords is giving me an energy of be careful on who you're opening up to, Leo, because this Justice card here, this Libra here is, and it don't necessarily have to be a Libra, but I feel like they're plotting against you. The Knight of Swords here. Maybe this Knight of Pentacles and this Knight of Swords here are collaborating with each other. Tell me more about this Knight of Swords here and this Knight of Pentacles here. This Knight of Swords here in reverse. 
And this Knight of Pentacles here, what is this about? This King of Pentacles. That King of Pentacles came back again. You got deception around you. Look at here. This Justice card, and I'm going to tell you something. Whoever this is, this is somebody close to you. Okay? Especially if it's a major arcana. So, in other words, it's, it, it could be somebody who knows too much information about you with this Nine of Swords here. And here it is, this son of a bitch, cold and calculated, trying to get shit out of you. Take it how it resonates. Either they're going to tell your lover, they're going to tell your boss, but somebody here is setting up some shit here is what I'm feeling here. You see what I'm saying here? The moon card here. Somebody trying to get some type of clarity and cause some type of freaking confusion on Leo. I'm just saying. The nine of cups here, yeah, because they pissed off about it. Somebody is coming and saying, look, the shit didn't work and they pissed off about it. Whatever it is that they try to set out, they're pissed off about it. And this is where you take your break. This is where you take your break, the four of swords here, removing yourself from this energy. The page of wands here, they may want to try to reach out, I don't know. But whatever this may be, the six of pentacles in reverse, they're not going to reciprocate the same thing back to you is what I'm getting here. about this moon card here spirit cancer pisces energy what is this moon card here spirit in the verse for leo be clear okay that queen of cups want to come back up again i'm trying to tell you this person ain't feeling it. this person could possibly be doing moon magic trying to create hostilities blockages not cutting out the bullshit maybe you're not even speaking to this person well, they can't get the breakthrough that they want. Whatever that may be. They can't get it, I feel, because you're protected. What is this moon card here? Reverse here and this queen of cups here. In reverse. The seven of swords here, but something gonna be it's gonna be revealed to you. Hmm. Hold on. Because I don't, I'm getting the energy like this queen of cups coming to talk to you. So we're going to run back and tell that Libra. Tell me more about this queen of cups here and this seven of swords here in reverse. You see what I'm saying? Oh my God. Oh my God. Look at this. Look how I come back up in reverse. Look at this. Look at this. The lover's card here. The queen of pentacles here. The page of cups. The page of swords. You're being watched. What in the hell? I'm trying to tell you. They're trying to cause confusion around you. I can go on and on about this. I freaking knew it. Because that Queen of Cups can be a selfish type of person. Okay? Some things going to be found out about it. This Queen of Cups is going to come and communicate with you. But it's going to cause an argument. It's going to cause a, a fight. A fight is going to break out is what I'm getting here. Okay? Somebody could have put you in a third party situation. And that's why you left. Okay, tell me more about this five of wands here, spirit. See what I'm saying? Being druggled. The lover's card here once again. Somebody could just ran on off with somebody else and left somebody hanging. Take it how it resonates. The ace of swords and keeps showing up in reverse. It's a lot of hostilities around this reunion. But the world card, so this cycle is closed out. The two of cups here. So somebody did leave somebody. The two of cups here in reverse. Pisces energy. Somebody being juggled. Okay. The queen of cups can also mean here too as well. Like maybe you gave yourself too much to this person. And now you're feeling burnt out with the deception that you found out about. Tell us more about this two of cups here. And this two of pentacles. Okay here. The two of wands here. Yeah. The Nine of Cups. Somebody.
somebody is trying to come into some type of relationship you have, Leo. I, I, I'm trying to tell you because look at here. You got here the two of one, I'm sorry, the two of pentacles here, the two of cups here, and you got the two of rods. The number two could be significant to you, okay? This is causing all this conflict. So somebody is trying to find a way to stir up some type of trouble in any type of relationship that you have. And this is how they, they feel fulfilled. They feel, and as I'm saying is the number two is here, two, 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 one, two, two, three. Okay, they're getting a kick out of doing this is what I'm getting here. Because their world is, 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 is fucked up. But whatever it is that they're trying to accomplish is not going to work. Okay, Leo. That's it. I'm done with this messiness. I'll see you next time. Bye.